Hello students, welcome back to our lecture series on corporate and business law. I'm thrilled to see you all here. In our previous lecture, we talked about what law is and why it's so important. Today, we're going to look at the sources of law in the UK and then dive into the types of law applicable as of 2024. So let's get started. Sources of law in the UK. One, legislation, statutory law, what it is. This is the law that's been formally passed by the UK Parliament and other devolved legislatures like the Scottish Parliament, the Welsh Parliament, and the Northern Ireland Assembly. Example. Think about the Equality Act 2010. This act pulls together and updates various anti-discrimination laws in the UK, making sure everyone is treated fairly regardless of their age, disability, gender, and other characteristics. Number two, common law, judge-made law. What it is. Common law is developed by judges through decisions made in individual court cases. These decisions set precedents that future cases will follow, ensuring consistency and predictability in the law. Example. A classic example is the case of Donahue v. Stevenson from 1932. This case established the modern law of negligence, making it clear that manufacturers owe a duty of care to the people who use their products. 3. European Union Law. What it is. Even though the UK has left the EU, EU law still has some influence, especially in areas where EU regulations were adopted into UK law before Brexit. Example, the General Data Protection Regulation, GDPR, is a good example. The UK has its own version now, called the UK GDPR, which governs how personal data must be handled to protect individuals' privacy. 4. European Convention on Human Rights. What it is. This is an international treaty designed to protect human rights and fundamental freedoms in Europe. It's incorporated into UK law by the Human Rights Act 1998, allowing people to bring human rights claims in UK courts. Example, for instance, in the case of RVA No. 2 in 2001, the House of Lords had to balance the right to a fair trial with laws restricting the admissibility of certain evidence. They decided the legislation should be interpreted in a way that upheld the right to a fair trial. 5. Customary Law What it is. These are traditions and practices that have been accepted as legal requirements over a long period. Example. One example is the custom of ancient lights, which gives property owners a right to receive light through defined windows, preventing neighbors from blocking the light. 6. Authoritative Texts what it is. These are influential legal texts and commentaries written by respected legal scholars. While they aren't laws themselves, they can guide judges in making decisions. Example, Blackstone's Commentaries on the Laws of England is a famous example that has historically shaped the understanding of common law principles. Types of Law in the UK as of 2024. 1. Common Law. Based on judicial decisions, common law evolves through the rulings of judges in individual cases. It covers areas like contracts, torts, and property law. 2. Statutory law. Created by Parliament, statutory law consists of written laws or statutes. It includes legislation on criminal law, employment law, and environmental regulations. 3. Civil law. This type of law deals with disputes between private parties. It covers family law, contract law, tort law, property law, and corporate law. 4. Criminal law. Criminal law involves laws relating to crime and punishment. It includes offenses like theft, assault, fraud, and murder. 5. Constitutional law. Governing the organization and functioning of the state and its institutions, constitutional law addresses the powers of government bodies, human rights, and constitutional interpretation. 6. Administrative law. This type of law regulates the actions of administrative agencies of government. It covers regulations, rulemaking, and enforcement of regulatory agendas. 7. Family law. Family law relates to family relationships, including marriage, divorce, child custody, and adoption. 8. Commercial law. Governing business and commercial transactions. Commercial law encompasses contracts, sales, commercial paper, agency, and partnerships. 9. Employment law. Regulating the relationship between employers and employees, employment law covers employment contracts, workplace safety, discrimination, and wages. 10. 
equity law. Equity law supplements common law to provide fairness and justice. It includes trusts, injunctions, and specific performance. 11. Human rights law. Protecting fundamental rights and freedoms, human rights law is derived from the European Convention on Human Rights, ECHR, and the Human Rights Act, 1998. 12. Environmental law. This type of law regulates human interaction with the natural environment. It includes pollution control, resource conservation, and wildlife protection. 13. International law. Governing relationships between states and international entities. International law comprises treaties, conventions, and agreements between countries. These types of law form the comprehensive legal framework of the UK, ensuring justice, order, and the protection of individual rights and societal interests. In our upcoming lectures, we will explore each type in more detail to give you a deeper understanding of their applications and implications. Thank you for joining today's session, and I look forward to our next lecture. Please remember to subscribe and like the video if you found this lecture helpful.